What's going on everyone, Rich Lee here, and today it's time for episode 11 of my Real Madrid career mode series. Now, going into today's episode, a lot of the players are lacking match fitness, and we've also got a couple of injuries as well. Carvajal is out until the end of February, Ronaldo's out until the end of January, and at the moment, the squad is looking quite thin. Also, I apologise that there is no face cam in today's episode, I've not been feeling too well the last few days, and... I look absolutely terrible, so rather than filming my face and scaring all of you, I've decided to not have face cam in today's video. Anyway though, let's get into the first game, and let's see how we do against Sporting Gijon. Lucas Vasquez is on the ball now, and I'm going to try crossing that one over to the back post. Not a bad ball, but we can't get anywhere near it. Isco's on it now then, plays that through, looking for the run of Gareth Bale. He gets onto it, gets taken down, and we've won a penalty there. So Isco steps up to take this one. I'm not very good at penalties, but I do tuck that one away, and it's 1-0. Here we come now then with Kovacic. He plays that out wide to Danilo. He's going to turn that back. Cross it over into a dangerous area. Really nice ball. And it's 2-0. So far, Sport and Gihon have been causing us no problems whatsoever. Here comes Kovacic now then. Plays that forward to Isco. What can he do here? He does a little ball roll. He's going to move that out wide to Lucas Vasquez. He turns that inside. Going to try and cross that over. Decent ball once again. Can we make it 3-0? No, we didn't even get to the ball. Gareth Bale's running at the defence here now then. Plays that out wide to Danilo. Crosses it over first time. Terrible ball. It's gone to Contral. He's going to cross it back over and it's another terrible ball. Casemiro's on the ball now then. Plays that forward looking for the run of Gareth Bale. Can he get to that? Nope. He crosses it over anyway though. And that is the halftime whistle. It's 2-0 at the break. And for the second half, I'm bringing on 57-rated Victor Velasquez for his debut. The board wants us to bring through some young players, and that's exactly what I'm doing here. We've got a 2-0 lead, so it's a perfect opportunity to bring on Velasquez. Lucas Vasquez is on the ball now then, plays that out wide to Contral. Can we get a third goal here? Contral crosses that over to the back post, poor ball, drops for Danilo. He plays that forward to Kovacic, he's going to take a shot at goal. That was absolutely pathetic. Vasquez is running with it now then, plays that to Velasquez for his first touch of the game. He's through on goal here, can he get a debut goal? No, it's been blocked. Right, let's try and find Gareth Bale on the near post. That's not a bad ball at all, but that is not a good header. It's okay though, we've got another a corner. I played that one short to Kovacic. He's going to cross that one over. Dangerous area. Can't get to it though. It drops for Danilo. Just take a shot of goal. That isn't too bad, but it's over the bar. Here they come down the wing now then with Castro. That is a really nice ball over, but we've got rid of it. And now we've got a chance to work an attack, have we? No, they've got the ball back and they're looking decent here. They played that out wide to Castro once again. He moves that to Laura and that is an awful ball. They've switched the play though, and that is a terrible touch. They've taken it out of play. Kovacic is working his way forward now then. Plays that to Velasquez. What can he do here? He's only 57 rated, but he's playing well there. Moved it through to Casemiro. And what can Casemiro do here? He's searching for the pass. Gonna play that through to Morata. And he can't quite get there. Here we come now then with Danilo. Plays that forward to Gareth Bale. He's gonna move this one over into the box. Nice ball over. And they've just about dealt with that. Kovacic is running with it now then. Plays that out wide to Contral. He's going to turn that back and search for a pass here. Who's going to make this possible? I see that run. Can it be 3-0? Poor shot. Casemiro's running with the ball now then. Goes for goal. And I thought that was going to be an absolute bouter of a goal. It hits the post and they've got rid of it. Sporting Gijon have got a late free kick now then. Can they make the most of this one? Decent ball, but Donnarumma's got that covered. And we're going to get this one away. Contral's on the ball. Going to move that forward to Casemiro. Can we get another goal here? That would be absolutely brilliant. Casemiro nearly scored a third a minute ago. I don't know how he got past that challenge, but he did. Moves it on to Danilo. He plays it down the line to Lucas Vasquez, who crosses that one over. Very good ball, and it's 3-0. Two-headed goals for Morata in this one, and we're going to pick up the 3-0 victory. Next up, then, we're taking on Athletic Bilbao in the Copa del Rey. We've got a 1-0 lead from the first leg. Let's go and pick up another victory. Asensio's running with it now then. Plays that out wide to Messi. He's going to cut that inside. Go for the finesse shot. That is poor. Messi's making a fantastic run there out wide. And he's got a chance to make it 1-0 here. Can he make this count? He didn't do well on the last opportunity. 
And he's been pushed off the ball there. We're going to cross that one over, are we? No, we can't quite manage it. Here they come now then with Inaki Williams. What can he do here? That is really good play from him, but we've just about dealt with that. Got it away to Benzema. He's going to move that on to Asensio. And we've got a chance here. Martial's making a fantastic run there. But I'm going to use him as a decoy. Play through Luka Modric. He's got to score this one. And he does. He finds the back of the net. And it's 1-0. Luka's on the score sheet once again. Rolling it into the back of the net. Keeper probably should have done better there, but I will definitely take the goal. It's 1-0. Here we go then. Martial's going to play that through to Benzema. Really nice ball there. And I thought that was going to be 2-0. Right then, let's play this one short to Messi. He's going to whip that one over to the back post. And it's 2-0. Sergio Ramos has got the header. Found the back of the net. And we've doubled the lead. Why is no one celebrating with him though? Everyone's just walking away. I'm pretty sure Sergio Ramos is one of the top goal scorers in the entire team. What an absolute legend. Tony Kroos is on the ball now then. Plays that through to Benzema. What can he do here? He's going to turn that back. Pass it across to Asensio. He goes past his man. Wriggling his way forwards. Moves that across. Poor ball. Tony Kroos is on the ball now then. Whips that one over. And that's straight at the keeper. Right then, Messi. What can you do here? You've not been great today. You do have an assist, but you've been fairly quiet. You played that through to Martial. He's going to turn that inside. Gets past his man. Plays it through to Benzema. And that's poor. Marcelo's running with it now then. Plays that through to Messi. What can he do here? Turns that inside. Gets around his man. Searching for the pass forward here. I see the run of Marco Asensio. And he finds the corner of the net. It's 3-0. Messi has his second assist of the game. And we are now absolutely cruising to victory. Rico's working the ball down the wing now then. Really nice ball over. And how did they not score that? Seriously, that should have been a goal. That was a really nice move. And they've hit the post. And we're away now. We're already 3-0 up. Messi's going to launch that forward to Morata. He takes on his man. Gets around him comfortably. Going to turn that inside. Gets around another one. And another one. Got to score this one. Make it 4-0. Oh, what a challenge. Bilbao have a late corner now then. That is a decent ball over. We've dealt with it though. Isco's on the ball. Looking for the run of Messi. In fact, he's going to take it to the left instead. Oh, back to the right. And that is the final whistle. We've picked up another... 3-0 victory. And for the final game of the episode, we're travelling away to Germany to take on Borussia Dortmund in the Champions League. Let's get out there and let's absolutely smash them in the snow. Here come Dortmund on the attack now then. And that is not quite the start that I had in mind. Dortmund have taken the lead through Ramos. Messi's on it now then. Plays that through looking for the run of Asensio and they've booted that out of play. Right then, let's play this one short to Messi. He's going to whip that one over to the back post. Really nice ball, but the keeper's claimed it. We've got a chance here then. Messi's been played through and he tried to go for a skill goal there and completely failed. Here come Dortmund once again then and that is 2-0. This is embarrassing now. Dortmund have just been playing with such intensity in this game and we haven't been able to cope with it. Tony Cruz is on the ball now then, plays that through and it's 2-1. We've got a goal back, probably don't deserve it, but I'll take it. It's 2-1, Martial's found the back of the net and we are back in the game. And we've got another chance here with Messi playing that through. We've been blocked off there and we couldn't quite get to it. Messi's running with it now then, plays that through to Gareth Bale. Can we get the equaliser here? Bale's been taken out in the box and that is a penalty. So up steps Messi, can we score this one? We can, just about. That is a terrible penalty, but it's 2-2. Seriously, let's just take another look at that one. Berkey dives the right way, but... Because the penalty had no power in it whatsoever, Berkey dives over the ball and we're back in the game at 2-2. This is absolutely ridiculous. I thought we were going to lose it. They were 2-0 up and absolutely cruising, but we've drawn level and game on. Here comes Marcelo now then. Plays that through to Messi. Can we make this 3-2 here with Leo Messi? Finds the corner of the net and we have indeed taken the lead. We were 2-0 down and now we're winning 3-2. Absolutely ridiculous comeback right there. And that was a lovely finish by Messi. Finds the corner of the net, slots it past the keeper. And we've taken the lead for the first time in this match. And I'm not too sure we deserve it, but I will definitely take it. And it's all just going horribly wrong for Dortmund right now. Gareth Bale's on it now then. Plays that to Tony Cruz. He moves that forward to Martial. He's going to whip that one over to the back post. And I thought we were going to get there. It's back to Martial and he heads that straight to the keeper. Tony Cruz is running with it now then. Plays that forward to Messi. He's on for his hat-trick here. Turns that back. Can he get his hat-trick? 
Gets taken down there, does he? Nothing given. And this is a fantastic opportunity to make it 4-2. And we can't take it. Right then, let's play this one short to Messi. He's going to whip this one over, try and find someone on the back post. Really nice ball. And we found the back of the net. It's 4-2. Those crosses to the back post just seem so overpowered in this game. And Morata came on as a substitute. And he's now on the score sheet. And that's the final whistle. We were 2-0 down. But ultimately, we picked up a 4-2 victory. Absolutely brilliant comeback. So I'll finish off the video there. We're second in the league, but we have played two games less than Real Betis. So we're doing pretty well. And I'd expect us to be top of the table come the end of the next episode. Also, if you've been waiting for me to answer the press conference questions, I will be doing that in the next video. So, if you've got any more questions for me, leave them in the comment section down below, and I'll do my best to answer all of those in the next video. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you again next time.